A big win for four female Des Moines Police Department employees. They just won millions after filing a sexual discrimination lawsuit. KCCI senior reporter Todd Magel is live at the Des Moines Police Station tonight with what this settlement means. Todd? Well, Ben, the Des Moines City Council approved the terms of the settlement uh, at its meeting tonight, but the employees who filed the suit say this fight isn't just about money. This is a great victory. Des Moines attorney Jill Zwagerman and her clients are celebrating the end of a long battle. These brave, courageous women um, have been fighting this for four years. Two Des Moines senior police officers, a police captain and an evidence specialist sued the city, claiming years of harassment in the department. Officer Tracy Rhodes won $1.1 million. The other three won just under a half million dollars each, all part of a settlement between them and the city of Des Moines. There was a sense of relief but at the same time, I had a slight bit of buyer's remorse because I wanted to tell my story. A story of getting passed over for promotions, of being sent nude photos, of being called obscene names. But they say it's not just the money. The main thing about this settlement agreement is that we're going to get some changes, some much needed changes. I never wanted to file a lawsuit, but here I am and here all of us are. And I think sometimes when it when it hurts financially, then changes are made. Those changes include new rules that require the police work with the city HR department during harassment investigations and the police investigators be professionally trained. We hope that it just makes the department a more comfortable, um, equal place to work. Now, in a statement from the city of Des Moines, uh, they say they admit to past in instances of what they call inappropriate conduct, but they deny many of the allegations in that original lawsuit. And the women say they will continue to work at the Des Moines Police Department.